over the last five years, we've seen so many new developments and so many new tools that are now available to advance the fight against HIV AIDS. In particular, we have really begun to understand the use of antiretrovirals, those are the drugs which are used to treat HIV, as effective tools to actually prevent HIV, especially in those who are HIV negative. These drugs can be used in various different formulations as tablets for pre-exposure prophylaxis or included in microbicides as vaginal microbicides to prevent the transmission of HIV to both men and women who are HIV negative. Another key use of the antiretrovirals is our understanding that treatment of those who are HIV infected is perhaps one of the most effective and powerful tools to reduce the infectiousness of the HIV infected per person, which has benefits for their own health as well as helps to reduce the onward transmission of HIV by more than 95%. And that's a tremendous reduction in the risk of onward transmission of HIV. And again, could be a very effective tool, not only in protecting the health of the individual, but of their partners and indeed of the community. These developments are part of the amazing changes that we've seen in the field, both here in the United States as well as globally. And I think that these changes have really inspired a new conversation about the beginning of the end of AIDS.